In the millennium all nations will come to Jesus to worship him and give him honor and praise. In the 1000 year reign of Jesus Satan will be locked in prison in chains. Revelation 20 verses 1 through 3. In the millennium all nations will make the journey to Jerusalem to worship King Jesus. Isaiah chapters 18 and 19 contain prophecy about Ethiopia and Egypt. In the 1000 year reign of Jesus, the Prince of Peace, these two nations will give honor to Jesus and will obtain special recognition. All the people on earth will know that Jesus died for their sins. Isaiah chapter 53. We esteem him stricken, smitten of God and afflicted. He was wounded for our transgressions. He was bruised for our iniquities. His torture brought us peace and healing. The Lord laid on him the iniquity of us all. He was oppressed. And he was afflicted. Yet he opened not his mouth. He is brought as a lamb to the slaughter. A sheep that is mute. Golgotha. He had done no violence. Neither was any deceit in his mouth. Yet it pleased the Lord to bruise him. He has put him to grief. His soul was an offering for sin. He shall justify many. Golgotha. A prophecy of David. Psalm 69. In my thirst, they gave me vinegar to drink. John 19:29. Now a vessel full of sour vinegar was sitting there. Vinegar for the king. Psalm 22:14. All my bones are out of joint. A prophecy by King David. All the people on earth will know that Jesus is the light of the world. John chapter 9 is a fulfillment of Isaiah 29, 18 of 35, 5 and 42 verses 6 and 7. The light of the world. I am. Amos 3, 7. Surely the Lord God will do nothing. But he revealeth his secret unto his servants the prophets. Haggai 2, 9. The glory of this latter house shall be greater than of the former, saith the Lord of hosts. And in this place will I give peace, saith the Lord of hosts. Bible note. This can only be a reference to the future millennial temple. For it was never accomplished in the restoration temple or in any other sins. Furthermore, in this future temple and not before, Christ will finally give peace to the world. Zechariah 2.10 Sing and rejoice, O daughter of Zion. For lo, I come, and I will dwell in the midst of thee, saith the Lord. And many nations shall be joined to the Lord in that day and shall be my people. And I will dwell in the midst of thee and thou shalt know that the Lord of hosts hath sent me unto thee. And the Lord shall inherit Judah his portion, in the holy land, and shall, choose Jerusalem again. After the one thousand years Satan is banished to hell forever. Revelation 20.10 And the devil that deceived them was cast into the lake of fire and brimstone where the beast and the false prophet are, and shall be tormented day and night forever and ever. Just as I told you in the garden with even Adam, you are banished into the lake of fire where you will spend eternity in torment. All of the saved will spend eternity in Jesus and joy, forever.